Hi, my name is Juan, and in case you didn't know, I was naturally born a nectomorph, which means I'm naturally pretty skinny with little to no muscle, and I have a really hard time gaining weight. However, I wanted to make a change, so at the beginning of this year, I set my goal to make my physique the best it has ever looked, and I achieved pretty good results, since in just one month, I was able to go from 54 kilos to 62 meaning that I gained 8 kilos of weight, which is around 17 pounds. But I didn't stop there, I continued to work hard and at the moment that I'm recording this video, I'm weighing 71 kilos. But the thing that amazes me the most is that I was able to pack on so much weight in such a short period of time, being just 4 weeks. I'm a hard gainer, so seeing that much progress that quickly is really abnormal to me. So that had me wondering, how did I do that? So after a lot of research, I came to the conclusion that there are two main factors that come into play on my bulking journey, and those are muscle memory and the new diet. Let's start off by explaining what muscle memory is. It's a topic that can get a little bit complicated, however, I'm going to explain it super simply. If you had worked out during a long period of time, and then you take a break, and then you come back to working out, that time that you come back, your gains will be so much easier to get than if you started from scratch. So let's say for example you have worked out during 6 months consistently and had enough, and then you take a break for any reason. When you come back from that break and you start working out again, it won't take you 6 months to recover from those gains, it will only take you 2 months to recover. And that is exactly what happened to me. If you remember my 30 day body transformation video, which I'm going to leave right here, if you haven't watched it, in that video I basically explained that during 2018 and most part of 2020, I worked out pretty consistently. However, at the end of 2020, I started, you know, missing some workouts and when I went working out, it was pretty mediocre. So when I started working out again at the beginning of this year, my muscle memory came into play and that made me have a lot of gains really quickly. So if you are new to the gym, if you haven't worked out in your entire life, don't expect to have the same results as I had. I'm not saying that you can't have a good body by any means, I'm just saying that thanks to my muscle memory hitting in, I was able to see the results much quicker. And for you that you are starting out, it might take you a little while. Unless you have like Greek god genetics or some really good veins in there, you know what I mean bro? <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it, I'm watching you, don't do it, don't do it. Now the second thing that made me gain that amount of weight was my new diet. In the past, even when I worked out, I really didn't put that much attention into what I eat. You know, I would normally eat until I was full, until I didn't feel hungry. And making your nutrition based on your hunger is a really bad habit if you are trying to build a physique, since your hunger is a representation of what your body wants, not what your body needs. So in the case of people like me with really high metabolisms, our body wants to have less food, but we actually need more food in order to build the muscle properly. So I did my research in order to know how many calories I needed in a day in order to build the muscle properly, and in my case, I ended up with a total of 3200 calories. So I made sure that every single day I had at least those 3200 calories, even when in most of the cases I didn't feel hungry at all. So that new diet made me gain a lot of energy in the form of calories and protein, two of the most important factors when trying to build muscle. Now if you want to know some of the best foods to have when trying to build muscle as a skinny guy, I'm going to talk about it in my next video. As always, like and subscribe if you did enjoy, and I see you in the next one, bye.